How do we determine which numbers go to the left and to the right? You subtract one of the mean, one standard deviation. Add and subtract one standard deviation. So if we subtract one standard deviation, what we say? Okay. Now, if we add one standard deviation, what do we get? Now, those are the two numbers it's asking about, isn't it? So I don't have to go any further out than this. I'm good so far. Now, it wants to know of a random sample of 15,000, how many are going to be between those two marks. Unfortunately, 10,000 is none of my four possible answers for number six. So, you do need to know the percentages that will go in the normal distribution curve. 34. Both of these are 34. Because it adds up to be 68. So, 34 in each part. So, what percentage of them are going to be up there? So, we need to find 68% of which number? <laughs> so that would be 0. 0.68 times 8,000. I, it's not always going to work out that nicely, or I promise. No, no, that's more of a happy coincidence with the numbers than anything else. Because if that had been like twenty, if that had been like twenty-five thousand, then your answer is closer to like the fourteen thousand.